Hello fellow gardener, this will be an unusual video in my channel because here in Latvia we love everything green and we are one of the cleanest countries in the world and almost everyone has their own greenhouse where we grow variety of vegetables. Before I start this polycarbonate greenhouse building project, I thought that this would be easier, but I was so wrong. This was a hard and tiring process. The existing greenhouse is 6 multiplied by 3 meters and is too small. That's why 10 multiplied by 3 meter polycarbonate greenhouse will be built next to this land cover that we still have to prepare for a greenhouse installation. The greenhouse Kinovsky Premium, a base frame of 3 multiplied by 4 meters, will be used for the construction of the greenhouse. Additionally, there are extension packs of 2 meters. In my case, there are 3 packs to have a 10 meter long greenhouse and also a 4 millimeter polycarbonate sheet. And here's the unboxed base frame box. Somehow all details have to be connected. Aside from this, three extension packages are still waiting. I grouped all parts by size and design to make it easier to combine them together. The frames will be strengthened together with self-drilling screws. But for additional safety, I will tighten all the screws by hand so that everything doesn't fly away. The end wall is assembled. It looks easy, but it really took two or three hours to find where everything goes. Also had to screw from the both sides. And here's the door with the window in process. The middle arc is assembled. Well, goodbye another three hours. The doors with small window and two more arcs are finished. While you relax your hands, make a frame in the ground where the greenhouse will be laid. Then one door with a window and end wall is again assembled. Currently we have assembled base greenhouse 3x4 meter housing with two end walls and three arcs. These polycarbonate sheets are very large. Well, they looked smaller. Now I try to cut polycarbonate parts for the end walls. Details are cut. Now we have to somehow screw them together. While hands are relaxing, dig a deeper ground frame for greenhouse. The usual hours have passed and the frame has been dug up. Well, I can say that while gaming time passes faster. For the foundation of the greenhouse, we will use square timber. Concrete will be better, but then again waiting three more days. Work continues of polycarbonate screwing. Everything goes slowly, like all related work. <laughs> well, it's a new day. Probably third. Yesterday, through the darkness, the first end wall and the arc were fastened. Finally, we can see some results. Another hour went past and two more arcs are here. Then again, after some time, two more. Also, third day is coming to the end. Finally, it starts to look like a real greenhouse. During the twilight, we didn't give up and finished so-called greenhouse skeleton. Fourth day starts with a lot of optimism. In the afternoon, the wind stopped and we placed part of polycarbonate. Even the smallest wind would make them fly. It is impossible to attach it and tighten it during the wind. And here's how it looks from the inside. Now we can finally call it a greenhouse. Sadly, fourth day is coming to end. It's a pleasure that all polycarbonate is laid and you can see the glimmering glow. At the moment, the feelings are very good. At the end of the day, the last clip with the sunset on a new 10 meter greenhouse wall. Fifth day begins. Today it's intended to cover bottom holes of the greenhouse. We will use wooden planks to cover the holes, which will be screwed to the greenhouse hull. And here's how they look. It would look better with wider planks, but I didn't have those, so I used two narrow ones. While it rains, I will show you how the boards look from the inside before they are covered with soil. I used the raining time productively and dug up the central passage. I was not lazy during the rain and I kept digging, because whole 10 meters must be dug up. Rain stopped and we finished the wooden bottom wreath and put it in concrete entrance area. Still, the soil should be patterned on the outer edge, but first we have to finish the inner work. Lay a cord where there will be a board edge. Start putting in the soil and smooth in the soil. Again, many hours have passed and 10x3 meter greenhouse ground is smoothed and is ready for farming. With the surrounding soil we can say that greenhouse is finally complete. Cook some delicious meat and think about where all these 5 days went. To be honest, I don't want to do this again because my hobby is audio. And also audio video will be the channel's main content. This kind of home stuff and DUI will appear rarely. Usually when mother in love or acquaintance needs some help. Good luck.